Hey, I'm live. I just wanted to raise awareness today um, that uh, see this fake money. You don't even know it's a fake five pound note. But when I went to the shop, maybe it's just scratch this off. And it was to, if I just check you out, check it out now. See, that's the front. If we scratched it, it starts to remove the colour. I'll just try it again. And I'll show you exactly how much I've just scratched off. So I've scratched off. You can see from the other way. Can you not see that? I've scratched it off. So that's one side absent. Okay, so I'm going to go the other side. Who is this man? I don't know who he is. <laughs> and I'm going to scratch him off, which the other side doesn't scratch off. It doesn't scratch off, but this side certainly removes all the features. So I want to continue. How do you get caught out? Well, that was your last five pound note. I've actually, as you can see, I've just scratched out the word five here, there, scratched out the word five. Now I'm going to carry on scrubbing it, like a scratch card, isn't it? And um, if this was your last five pounds and you needed it, you needed it literally to buy gas and electricity or something, baby milk, and you get to the shop and they tell you it's a fake. Look at that. You see all the blue? It's been able to be scratched off. I'll do it from all of those angles. You see? Yes, you might be able to see him through it, but at the end of the day, the other side doesn't get scratched off, but you can still see through it. This is a fake £5 note, and I got caught out with this today, going to the shop, going to purchase my products. And they said, it's fake. So they started to scrub all of this off. Oh, look. All of this, the blue stuff. It scratches off like this and then you have a useless five pound piece of paper sorry decided to be outside today you know they say money grows on trees this is not really a joke really there's people with the last five pound and they've been given this i know exactly where i got this money from what shop it was but whether or not they checked it themselves that's up to them what can i do about this well many people would try and be smart hand the money over, um, try and purchase something and hope that somebody wouldn't check the other end. Personally, I'm been in it. I'm not going to be responsible for somebody else committing fraud, lying, having a conscience that isn't clear because they've given somebody a dud five pound note. Oh, nah, I'm going to make this so useless that it is useless, literally useless. Not worth the money it's written on, right? So, yeah, just watch out for those dodgy dodgy five-pound notes. Um, obviously, when you scratch it, the colour comes off. Um, it's all under my nails. Um, literally blue ink. And I just think it's disappointment. That could have bought baby food, that. And so, um, people, check your money. Check your change. If you're giving change... At the stores, check it there and then before you leave the store. Check it when it's been given to you because the person on the other end may not have checked it. And in my case, it doesn't look like they checked it or if they did, they decided to give it back to me. Uh, it's no good to me now and it's not going to be any good to anybody else. So I'm, I have a clear conscience not to try and pass that over to somebody else um, and get some kind of money back uh is is this pointless a pointless exercise you should be ashamed of yourself whoever did fake money like this be ashamed because there are people out there that probably won't get any gas or electricity or baby milk or anything like that or diapers and it could have been their last five pound no and some somebody created this fakeness it's a little like, bit like friends isn't it <laughs> Fake friends are real friends but when it comes to money when it comes to money you know that's things that that's people people's lives and their livelihood um so yeah i've actually never actually burnt money before but put my pocket money by accident in a fireplace at one point but yeah 
fake money. That would distress somebody out if that was all they had. It really would. And so just be mindful of these these fake money that's going around. I can't believe I was given it. And, and for me, I'm just like, you know what? I'm going to use it to raise awareness with it. And that's what I've done. So my money is on me selling the truth. Is it on you when you receive one? Are you going to try and see if you can purchase something and get away with it? Have a clear conscience. Do the right thing. Okay, I got caught out today just by somebody not doing the right thing. Do the right thing. That's a mind over matter, isn't it? And just one project will talk. Do you like it? It's quite nice, isn't it? So that's all I had to say today. Stay positive. Um, stay positive. Stay encouraged, and continue to raise awareness. Um, just so you can help other people, would you please share? the wealth of education that's all i ask for we don't want anyone else to get caught out so just share the awareness thank you very much for listening i am discouraged encouraged i'm doing me i'm i'm doing me i'm trying to do the best that i can to raise awareness with the limited tools that i have and um i'm doing me i'm being honest <laughs> 